Southeast Asia destinations are cheap countries to visit and Vietnam is no exception. However, there are still some more ways that you can save money if you are on a super tight budget. This is Katie from Creative Travel Guide and today we are sharing the best ways to save money in Vietnam. Looking for more travel tips? Make sure you hit subscribe and ring that notification bell. Now my first tip is to eat local. There is no better place that this tip applies to. Eating local food will always save you money and in Vietnam it can make a huge difference. The local street food is delicious so stick to the stores, vendors and hole in the walls. My next tip is to use the happy hours. Vietnam has many bars to choose from but check the deals and happy hours to make the most of your drinking budget. This is especially true in the touristy destinations such as Hanoi and Ho Chi Minh City. Also drink Bai Hoi. Beer is cheap in Vietnam but Bai Hoi is said to be the cheapest beer in the world. You can get this for as little as 30 cents or 10p. My next tip is to haggle. When buying items in markets, make sure you haggle the price. We found it easier to buy items from those that advertise their prices, but if you want to buy something without a price, haggle or walk away to get the best price. Another tip for the Vietnamese cities is to get walking. There are so many things to see and do in the cities and many attractions are free, but you can save money by walking everywhere or renting a bike for as little as $1. If you are going to look at taxis, we recommend using the Grab app. This is a really easy app, it's very similar to Uber, but it means that you won't get overcharged in touristy areas. Now my next tip is to pay in Vietnamese dong. Vietnamese dong and dollars are accepted in most places in Vietnam, but it is better to pay in Vietnamese dong. When we first visited Vietnam in 2013, everyone preferred the dollars, but now in 2020, we found everyone preferred Vietnamese dong. Some places would accept dollars, but would massively overcharge you. So it's much cheaper to stick to using the local currency. Now let's talk about getting around. So usually flying is more expensive than any other way of traveling a country, but here that is not the case. Flights and trains are cheap, so make sure to compare prices around Vietnam. Booking flights in advance directly with Vietjet can save you a lot of time and money. However, if you aren't booking your trip ahead of time, you can use the overnight buses. By using an overnight bus, you can save money on transport and accommodation. Another tip to think about is using private rooms. Hostels are all over Vietnam and are cheap. However, private rooms in hostels and hotels are just as cheap. So if you are traveling as a pair or group, you will likely save more money by having a private room. And my last tip for saving money in Vietnam is to shop around for tours. If you are in Vietnam for some time, you are likely going to want to visit Ha Long Bay whilst you're in Hanoi and the Chu Chi channels whilst you're in Ho Chi Minh City. We recommend you compare prices of tours online before arriving and contact the companies directly. They often offer you better prices when booking directly with them, especially for things like Ha Long Bay. Alternatively, if you do book watch or in the city, make sure you shop around and go to a few of the different tour companies for the best price and the best tour for you. We hope you have an amazing time in Vietnam. Let us know what you are looking forward to doing in the comments below. Take care. Thank you for watching. Make sure you hit subscribe if you like the video. And until next time, stay creative.